A vertical single-stage centrifugal pump is trying to draw. In centrifugal pump, liquid enters the center or eye of the impeller, and flows radially out between the veins, its velocity being increased by the impeller rotation. A diffuser or volute is then used to convert most of the kinetic energy in the liquid into pressure. So, centrifugal pump is a dynamic pressure displacement pump, where tangential acceleration of fluid is imparted into pressure energy by centrifugal force due to the rotation of the impeller. Materials Casing, gun metal for sea water, cast iron for fresh water. Impeller, aluminium bronze. Bearing, and Ring seal, leaded bronze. Shaft, stainless steel. Why relief valve is not fitted to a centrifugal pump? A centrifugal pump is not a positive displacement pump. So they can run against a closed outlet pressure and produce the locked outlet pressure. But no harm will be done. The liquid will circulate inside the pump, the power requirement will drop as there is no displacement, but that's it. The liquid inside the pump body will be heated up by the friction, so it should not last too long. At least, there is no need for a relief valve like on positive displacement pump. State distinct characteristics that separates centrifugal pump from other pumps. Flow varies with changing pressure. Efficiency decreases with increasing viscosity. A dry pump will not prime on its own unless its casing is filed with liquid. Converts rotational energy into moving fluid. A type of dynamic axisymmetric work absorbing turbo machinery. Why centrifugal pump may require a priming pump. Priming is the process in which the impeller of a centrifugal pump will get fully submerged in liquid without any air trap inside. This is specially required when there is first start up. It is always advisable to start the pump only after priming. When elevation of liquid in the suction tank is less than the elevation of the pump, that time priming is required for centrifugal pump. Centrifugal pump can not suck the liquid but push the liquid. Liquid enter in the suction of centrifugal pump by the energy it posses, atmospheric pressure in the suction tank. Usually, to lift the liquid, centrifugal pump push the liquid, and due to the pressure difference, liquid enter in the suction side provided suction line is completely filled with liquid, called primed. During the start-up of the pump, if air pocket is present in the suction side, then pump will push the air, and it will not generate enough momentum. As a result suction air will try to expand, and it will block the liquid from entering into the centrifugal pump. Also, if pump is allowed to run in this condition for longer duration, it will overheat the system and eventually pump will fail. So to avoid these problem we do the priming operation.